for Elizabeth in the first movie. Yes, yes. And then now you've won at the Golden Globes and the Screen Actors Guild and you're nominated for an Oscar. How are you feeling with all this acclaim? I feel bloody great. I mean, it's incredible, yeah. The best, you know, professionally the most amazing year of my life. Mm -hmm. Of course, it started with getting the roles. Mm -hmm. And I think it was Jeremy who said tonight, you know, we, oh no, it was uh, uh, Hugh Laurie who said, you know, we, we're all good, but we can't be good without the role. I just got incredibly lucky last year, and I got two amazing, or well, three amazing roles. Prime Suspect, Elizabeth I, and, and the Queen. They just all happen to happen in one year. It's the way things work sometimes. Yeah, yeah. Now, you said something that was so funny in your speech, saying that you you, you thought that once you saw the wardrobe yeah, of the I Queen... I can't do this. <laughs> How bad was that wardrobe? <laughs> oh, bad. <laughs> Very bad. So, you know, those tweed skirts that only mathematics teachers wear, you know, and sensible shoes and... And but you were able to look past and fall in love with her anyway. Yes, yes. Fall in love with her because of the clothes she wears, actually, in the end. Mm -hmm. A woman without vanity. A beautiful woman, originally, but without vanity. A great woman. Absolutely. And, you know, when I was looking at your category um, tonight, I was thinking, you know, so many people say that there's ageism in Hollywood, but you've got yourself, you've got Judi Dench, you've got Meryl Streep. Do you feel like maybe ageism is, is going away in Hollywood? It won't go away because, you know, the truth is we want to watch beautiful young women, men and women on the screen, and that's the truth, and I do too. But the other truth is that it's as you get older that you get, you as a person get more interesting. And also, therefore, the roles that you get to play actually get to be more interesting, funnily enough, as you get older. More complex, more, you know, deeper roles. Um, you couldn't play Elizabeth I as a 16 or 21 year old. So she hasn't done anything. No. Um, as a 50 year old, she's a fascinating woman. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Now, how, does, how do you feel when you hear that you're a uh, favorite for an Oscar? It's not a horse race. <laughs> I feel a bit like Smarty Jones. Do you remember Smarty Jones? Yes, yeah, she did. Yes, she won two and yeah. then failed on the third yeah. one. So, um, you know, I'm not Smarty Jones. Um, wow. I'm, I'm an act. I'm just an actress. Right. Honored to be honored amongst other great actresses. 